Ave Satanus, Ave Lucifer, Ave Lord Belial, Ave Lord Leviathan, Ave Beautiful Beautiful Queen Lilith, Ave Beautiful Queen Lilith, Ave Lord Astaroth, Ave Lord Pazuzu, Ave King Paeamon, Ave Lord Maamon, Ave King Azazel, excuse me, Ave King Asmodeus, Ave King Asmode, Ave Lord Glorious, Ave Lord Vereen, that goddamn thing makes some noise, man. But anyway, that's not what I came out to make a video about with that thing. That thing making a noise. Or that reflection. But anyway. That being said, hail Satan. <laughs> hail Satan, brothers and sisters. I hope you have a great night. I hope you have a great Friday night. I don't know if I'll get this video uploaded tonight or not. I'll try. But, that being said, my internet connection is very fucking slow. I don't know what, I don't know why it is, but it is. Like, I'm paying for internet service, and it's like, a mother hen is faster. Like, a lot faster. Like, it's ridiculous, to be honest with you. It's bullshit, actually. That's bullshit, Lisa. That's bullshit, Johnny. No, it is. It is complete bullshit. I'm paying for the internet, so why not have it faster, right? And I'm assuming that 5G network system that they're talking about putting all over the globe, the 5Gs that they're planning on putting all over the world, I would assume that that has something to do with the... I will guess that it has something to do with the internet. That would be my guess. But. I wish the fuck they'd hurry up and do it if they're doing it. If it makes the internet any faster. And that's true. I really do. But. I don't know if that's the case or not. But that's not what I came out to make the video about. Yeah. I had a. Uh, a message left me on Facebook yesterday. And the message, uh, not on Facebook, I didn't have it on Facebook, that's a lie. It was on social media, obviously. Uh, it was on YouTube. And actually, the message was, what, the message came from, I don't know, I, I got an idea who it was. But I can't really remember their pen name right now. Uh, asked me why I worship Satan. And that's the truth. That's exactly what the, what the question was. Why I worship Satan. Okay. Where do I begin? Why I worship Father Satan. Number one. First of all, Father Satan's not a liar. King Lucifer is not a liar. Beautiful Queen Lilith is not a liar. King Asmodeus is not a liar. Lord P King Pazuzu is not a liar. Lord Belial ain't a liar. Lord Florius ain't a liar. King Paimon ain't a liar. King Asmodeus ain't a liar. King Asmodeus is not a liar. Uh, King Azazel is not a liar. Queen Tiamath is not a liar. Uh, Lord, any... Any and all of the demonic, okay? Every demon and every demoness that's in history. Every demoness and every demon that exists. All tell the truth. Contrary to, contrary to what's been said and spoken about them over so, millennials... From ever since the beginning of taunt, since the beginning, if you can want, you know, all, all, of course, according to all the science, if you want to believe their bullshit, which I don't, and I never will, uh, if you want to believe all the religious bullshit, they're all liars. All, uh, everything to do with Satanism, Father Satan, it's all lies. I don't, and my father is not a liar. Okay, number one. 
I consider I, I consider Lord Satan my father. Actually, he is my father. I don't consider him. I know he is. 100, 666%. And I got that off one of my sisters, actually. That's how come I started saying the 666% part. Because one of my true sisters, uh, she used to say it, so... And I, I think she... I don't know where she is. She disappeared. Like, she was there for a while on social media, and then she disappeared. I don't know, like... I hope not. I hope nothing serious happened to her. I hope nothing happened to her at all. Not a thing, because I think the world of her. She's a really great sister, and she's very intelligent. And believe you me, she's one. She's truly when she says she's six hundred and sixty-six percent true Satanist. Believe you me, I know what I'm saying, and I can guarantee you right now, she ain't lying. She's 100%, she's 666% honest with what she's saying. She has a tattoo of Father Satan on her face. She, she has Satan tattooed on her face. She has, and she had a new tattoo of Satan on her arm. So I'm telling you right now, you're not getting no more devoted than that. And I don't care who the person is. Now with that being said, to get back to the question at hand. Why I worship Father Satan? Why would I worship someone, meaning the Zion pig, okay? Meaning the Zion crap. Why would I worship, why would I worship that piece of garbage and, and some dead Jew hanging on a, some dead Jew nailed to a stick of wood? Why would I worship that? Why would I cry to that? Why would I be why do why would I go to a building, a church, and cry like a baby and jump up and down like an idiot? Okay? And worship something that caught something that wants something that tries to force you, tries to force you, unless you're a Father Satan's child, tries to force you to worship it. Father Satan doesn't try to force it. It's father, one thing about Lord Satan. Okay? He doesn't try to force anybody to worship him. At all. He doesn't try to force anybody to worship him. It's your choice. If you choose to worship Father Satan, you better do it correctly. Or not at all. I will say that right now. And I do not care. And I do not care who the person is. If you want to worship Father Satan, you better be in. You better be in it, one hundred percent. You better be a true sinister Satanist, because if you're not, you're just wasting Father Satan and the demonic's time, and they won't have and they won't have nothing to do with you. And I mean nothing. Like if you're not one hundred percent in, you're not at all, because there's no sitting on the fence. And there's no, oh, I'll say that I'm going to be, oh, I'll pretend that, I'll, or I'll just be a keyboard Satanist. Or I'll do it to make my parents mad, my mom or dad mad, or some bullshit like that. No, 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 no. It don't work that way. You have to be 100% in or not at all. That's the way it's always been. That's the way our ancients worship. That's the way our ancient our ancients worship Father Satan. Be it whatever you want to call him, Father Satan, Lucifer, King Lucifer, you know, the devil, whatever you prefer to call him. But I can guarantee you right now, people that do people that pretend and fake that they're worshiping Father Satan. Okay, the wannabes. The wannabes, the ones that pretend it. They have no no idea what the fuck they're dealing with. They really do not true. They really do not truly grasp. They truly do not grasp and understand. They really do not true grasp. They truly do not grasp and understand the power that Father Satan truly holds. The true power that he has, and the true power that the demonic has. You have to think about this. Father, I, I worship Father Satan because number one, 
number one, I got freedom to do whatever I want. Okay? Number two, I do it because I love them. Number two, I do it because I love them. And number three, I don't have to explain my reasons for worshiping Father Satan to nobody. And I mean nobody. But, I will say this. Number one, I just mentioned it, freedom to do whatever we want. You know, within reason, besides hurting kids and stuff like that, right? That's completely out of the question. I totally disagree with that. You know? But I think, but... I know I I know many of my friends I know I know some true Satanists and they are really true Satanists that they honestly believe in Father Satan and they worship Father Satan the same way I do and I know that for a fact they don't just pretend they are on, on social media they really do and I'm not just saying that I truly mean it if I didn't mean it I wouldn't say it And am I going to hell? Yeah, I am. Not a chance. I know that for a fact. I know 100% for a fact I'm going to hell. But. There's a big but involved too. But I know when I get to hell. I am going to have a nice beautiful throne waiting for me. I'm not going to be tortured for eternity like millions of other people are going to be. Especially the fakes, the phonies, the keyboard Satanists, and the ones that mock Father Satan. Because you do not mock Father Satan or any of the demonic. Like I said in numerous videos before. That's one thing you do not do, and I don't care who the hell you are. I don't care who the fuck you are. If you mock Father Satan, you can be the most, have the most money in the world. You can be the richest person in the world. If you mock, and if you mock Father Satan, you're going to pay for it dearly when you die. And before you die. Because before you die, you're going to end up in the, loony, in, this, in the puzzle factory. I can name people right now that I know 100% that are going to end up, that are going to wind up in the puzzle factory. I know that for a fact. And I'm not just saying it, I really do mean it. And you know what? They got nobody to blame but themselves. And when they're standing in front of Father Satan... And when Father Satan says to them, when Father Satan looks at them and says to them, Oh, you denied me when you were alive. You said I didn't exist. You said you just worshipped me as an archetype, as a figurehead. You didn't worship. You said you didn't worship the devil. You said you didn't worship Father Satan. You said you didn't even worship any Father Satan's demons. So, that being said, see ya, bye bye, and then there's a couple, a couple demons there that will just drag your fucking carcass off, and you're done. You're done till the day you die. Suppose you live to be a million. Suppose you live to be a, you're done for eternity. Not till the day you die. You're done for eternity. Period. No question mark. No explanation point, no chance to say, well, I didn't really know what I was doing. I'm not sure about what I was doing. I can't remember doing, you know, I didn't really mean to say what I said. Yeah, you. F I, didn't really, I didn't really know what I was doing when I was, what are you going to say? I didn't know, you didn't know what you were doing when you were, uh, I just came in the spare room there for a sec. What are you going to say? You just didn't know, you didn't know what you were doing when you, uh, when you said that, uh, what are you going to say? You didn't know you were, what you were doing when you were, uh, when somebody, at, when a person asked you, oh, do you, work, do you worship Father Satan as an archetype? Or a, as a god? That he truly is? Or are you a Levan? Or do you belong to the Temple of Satan? Or something similar to that. And if you say, probably, you, first thing, you'll be shit-baked. So you probably won't say nothing, because you'll be scared to death to say anything when you sit, stand, when you stand, when you're, when you're in Father Satan's presence. 
So number one, you're going to be scared to death to say anything. Father Satan will say it for you. And then he'll say, see ya. Bye bye. But I can promise you right now, I know I have a throne in hell waiting for me. I know that for a fact. And you know what? I'm glad I do. I have an 88-year-old mother. She's religious. My mother is. She's still alive. She's 88. And she's still kicking. You know, and she watches all them Sunday church programs. Like, she don't send them any vast... She don't send them any money or any of that. But she listens to their bullshit on Sunday. Right? Or Sunday. Sorry, I meant to say Sunday. And... She even asks... She don't realize... Like, she knows that I'm, she thinks that I'm a Satanist, but she don't really, where she's, so, where she's really old, she don't grasp what it really means, right? But she knows that I'm fucking a Satanist, but she, that's all she knows, right? She don't really know anything about it, because she's 88, right? But, you know, uh, I can guarantee you right now, I know I'm going to hell with Father Satan, and I know many of my brothers and sisters, my true brothers and sisters, that is, are, I know are going with me. And I can't wait. I really can't to get the fuck off this earth. But I really do hope I'm here for the Battle of Armageddon. I really do hope I'm alive for that and healthy. For, so if I can watch Father Satan ganking, and I can watch the Antichrist ganking people, I really do hope I'm here for that, and that's the truth, I'm not lying, I really do honestly hope I'm here for that. I really do, and I hope some of my brothers and sisters are here for the same thing. Actually, I hope a lot of my brothers and sisters are here for the same thing. But I can promise you right now, as true as I'm talking to you, as true as I'm making this video, I love Father Satan, Father Satan loves me. I love all of the, I love every demon, both dem and demoness, the ones that are known and the ones that are unknown. And they love me. I love doing satanic and demonic rituals because I get something out of it. And they also get something out of it. And have I... I've... <laughs> all I can say is... I love to that guy who, who sent me the, uh, the message asking me why I worship Satan. Because with Father Satan you get it like it is. He tells the truth. You don't get a million different stories from 20... You don't get 20 different stories from 20 different people about religion. I'm not in a religion. I'm in... I believe... I got... I consider myself and my satanic belief, my demonic belief, my necromantic belief, my de... You know, I, I consider myself... I'm in a belief system. It's my belief system, my personal belief system with Father Satan and all of the demonic. None of this bullshit about, uh, none of this crap about, uh, oh, your religion. Which religion are you? I need her fucking religion. And I mean that 100%. My belief system is true, traditional, spiritual, theistic Satanism. I'm Father Satan's child, and I always will be Father Satan's child until the day I die. Whether that's tomorrow, tonight, or 20, 30, 40 years down the road. I have been all my life, and I always will be. And with that, I love Father Satan. I love all the demonic. Ave Satanus. Ave Lucifera. Ave Lord Belial. Ave Lord Leviathan. Ave Lord Florius. Ave Lord Vereen, Ave Lord Croxel, Ave Lord Dandelion, Ave Lord King Pazuzu, Ave King Azazel, Ave King Asmodei, Ave Beautiful Queen Lilith, Ave Lord Leviathan, Ave King Asmodeus, Ave King Lucifer, Ave Lord, Lord Leviathan, and I'll talk to you next, brothers and sisters. Hail Satan.